Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are jam packed with some serious cleaning motivation from outside to inside two days worth of inside this is all after having a spent thanksgiving with the family and uh having family over it was just this house was a wreck plus i also decluttered or not declutter i de-decorated undecorated um for thanksgiving so all of our thanksgiving decorations are coming down in this video um giving my house at least two days before i start putting up christmas decorations so i hope you guys are ready for some serious motivation but first i want to tell you guys about this product in this video we're going to be doing two giveaways to two people um i had used this product once before which is super clean um in the apartment in ohio and I my reactions were real I will uh, try to remember to link it um, down below or if not at the end of the video so that you guys can go see this product used um, in other places of the home but this product is is insane so my husband used it on his tires and if you guys aren't familiar with what my husband does so he travels for work and he does use his truck quite a bit um, and so all of this residue is all brake pad residue and so we wanted to make sure that his wheels got a good shine and good clean and i wanted to show you guys a before and after of what it was so you guys saw the before and soon you'll see the after i also link this on my instagram page um, on if you are not following me there uh, my handle was just posted or just um, popped up on the bottom of the screen if not it it will come up again later on in the video but you guys this looks amazing look at these wheels they look amazing again super clean we'll be doing uh, two giveaways on this channel um, and at the end of the video i'll let you know how you can enter So we're going to start off in the kitchen and the kitchen needed to get some serious uh, TLC. So yes, this is the day after Thanksgiving. Although the day of Thanksgiving, we were cleaning, we were putting things away, we were washing the dishes, but it was still a lot um, of things that were needing to get taken care of. And so I'll be doing it in this video and then you will see when it said two days, the very next day um, is probably another thanksgiving uh explosion in the kitchen um leftovers you guys if you know anything about leftovers you know that the leftovers all of the leftovers get brought out everyone decides to dive in and then we put it all back but then there's still a mess everywhere so that is uh will be happening towards the end as well um part two or day two of today's video so um i hope you guys had a beautiful thanksgiving i hope you guys were able to enjoy your family um i was very pleased that this year we did not partake in the craziness of of black friday like we normally do um and quite honestly i wasn't truly um excited for it so i was able to do my shopping online at home and um enjoy my family how thanksgiving was meant to be spent and uh around uh people that you're you know thankful for and so um we were just happy that we were able to have um the hubs home for thanksgiving and that we were able to enjoy his company and that's very big for us if you already know if you're not new to my channel you know that um as i said earlier in the video that my husband does travel for work so there's times where he's not home um for a long you know extended of time but then there's times where he is home for quite some time and so but we also travel to ohio to be with him um when we know that that is going to happen so um but that is you know just a gist of our, our you know a little window of you know our family and how we spend our thanksgiving um my mother was able to come over my mother-in-law was not able to come over um but we did have two other uh guests that we spent a lot of our time with um from our church uh, that came over and it just it felt nice and 
quaint and like family so again i hope you guys had a beautiful thanksgiving and if you are new welcome my name is rosa and i hope you enjoyed today's video again today's video is jam-packed we're looking at nearly 40 minutes 38 minutes and 58 seconds of insane ultimate intense cleaning you guys um i hope you enjoyed today's video i hope you consider subscribing and joining my youtube family giving this video a thumbs up hitting that notification bell so that you are notified when new videos are posted we have a huge goal here on this channel to build our community up to a thousand subscribers by the end of july and i know that we are capable and able of reaching that milestone you guys i have been working so hard in the past month on my channel um, it's grown um, since then but i just have a vision um, and i've prayed about it with god and it has not left <laughs> it's not left my heart so i know that we will definitely get there and um, with your help um, most definitely so if you know anyone that is needing some motivation today or just a little pick me up you know please share this video um, and again and if you are new i hope you consider subscribing so let's go ahead and jump right on in into some more cleaning um, and getting this house back in order
so now we're in the dining room and we're needing to get this area get cleaned up and um, this was going to be the end of day one right after I do some laundry swapping over you know swap out the laundry put in a new load a uh, new load um, wipe down the mirror wipe down the sliding glass door because we'll be headed out to my son's um, football game and yes the week of Thanksgiving the day after Thanksgiving you're wondering what do you mean a football game well they had made it out I believe to either states or champions I'm not sure which level it was first but um, they were out about two hours away that we needed to go and watch him play um, I absolutely love sports at least watching my kids play um, but it was bittersweet to see the season end um, for them as uh, they did go into overtime they were tied went into overtime um, posing team got a touchdown made the extra point we also got a touchdown but we didn't make that extra point so we lost by one but overall um it's just it's pretty huge for him for him to be part of something this large um he's a sophomore and he still has two more years on varsity um and so we're just excited for him and his growth so with that being said um you know i'm going to go ahead and finish up undecorating getting um, a lot of the pumpkins put away you won't see me necessarily organize it in this video but a day two video you will see me that uh, see that i will organize all of this stuff i was just really wanting to get everything down so that i can go ahead and get it somewhat cleaned and ready um, so that I can uh, decorate this coming up week for Christmas. So day two, next day, of some cleaning. Uh, you guys, I, I can't tell you how messy the house got the very next day. I don't understand how. If you look behind me, you'll see my dining room table got messy again. But I wanted to start off this video with some laundry and give you guys some laundry motivation. Um, I was able to finally finish the laundry this day from the clothes that I had started the day before and started on some more um as well or more clothes as well but um we needed to just get some of this stuff taken care of um so i will be going back into the dining room cleaning that up i'll be going back into the kitchen and getting that all cleaned up but before before we do that let's go ahead and finish on some laundry I know I can be safe with you. You 
you want me now, I know you do I know you're being patient and I love you for that You show me how to dare to love So tell me what you're thinking of Cause I won't be afraid, not holding anything back Now it's time to take down the mantle and undecorate it. What I've noticed in this video is while I was undecorating, I'm not a fan of taking things down. I don't like undecorating, um, but I do love the clean slate that it gives. Um, undecorating meaning taking down fall decorations and putting them back up or taking down Christmas uh, decorations and putting those back up. So maybe that's why I only stick to those two uh, times of the year that I decorate every time every other time it's just my regular house with uh, bright colors if I can find something such as the greenery um, but even with that it's typically just um, white flowers as you can see that's on my uh, TV stand and over there on my bookshelf um, I don't really do a lot of um, bright colors or, or wild or anything wild and crazy um, and so when I do decorate for the fall and for Christmas I go out so if you are excited for that um, I know I am so late in the game um, for decorating for Christmas but we truly do wait until the day after Thanksgiving to uh, take things down uh, meaning the fall decorations and then put up um, and so we will uh, put up as much as we can um, so that my house doesn't feel like it's like Macy's explosion or Macy threw up in my house but Christmas is my favorite time to decorate for uh, so when I do decorate I tend to spend a lot of time making sure uh, that I've got everything that I need I think I have about uh, five totes that are up in the attic maybe even six uh, they somehow seem to be growing I'm not sure why um, but I do know that uh, this year I will be going through um, my Christmas bin I went through my fall bin as I was putting things away um, and organizing it just a little bit so that I was able to um, you know take things that I keep things that I want and to get rid of things that I don't want so um, you will see that uh, here shortly but um, now that I will be packing up all of my fall decorations um, I will move on into you know doing uh, finishing up cleaning wiping down the uh, coffee table and vacuuming and uh, sweeping and all that good jazz
So we've made it into the den and this area as if you guys are not new you know that my struggle with this area just trying to get um, a good uh, vibe or groove or something and so we're actually gifting this is and this is a toy chest um, I got it for my boys um, and I was going to paint it but uh, I didn't get around to it and then I said I was going to put a cushion on it to give us some seating on it but I never around I never got around to do that so one of my friends um, one of my dearest friends she is uh, I don't want to say adopting um well she's welcomed a little boy into her home um and helping helping him out um for the time being and she's needing some help and getting some furnishings and so i told her i said look i've got a, a chest i can give you um and uh it was a project so she knows the jits about about it but um she said that's great because he's been wanting a toy chest and so I think this would be perfect for him um, but I'm excited to get you know give it a good home a new home another little boy that would definitely utilize it my boys did utilize it but they had too many toys so it, it always propped open <laughs> so um, I needed to find a new home for all of my CDs um, and uh, I I used to be a big CD hoarder um, I know hoarding is pretty uh, it's it's you can't take it like I don't know you can just there's the word hoarding is just there's something about it but um, I was a CD a holic no that's not even good either I don't even know I used to love CDs there you go um, and I was sad that the car that I have now does not play CDs and so my husband was making fun of me he goes well, what are you gonna do with your entire CDs uh, collection well it'll just stay and so opening this up i didn't realize how many i actually have so we're going to go ahead and clean this space out i'm just going to put my cds away until it's time for me to really you know go through it and declutter them or get rid of them because i just can't seem to get myself to get rid of them just yet uh i know emotional attachment to things that don't need to have emotions i don't i don't know i don't even know if that's even said right but um i need to just go ahead uh, and get this area cleaned up and organized um, because we will be getting a shelf in here so this room will be coming along it's coming along it'll get put together the way that I feel that it needs to be and so um, we were gifted a shelf unit um, that I have to go pick up from one of my uh, from a best friend of mine um, and so I can't wait to get that and put that in here and it's going to come together so nicely
I can see the fire that we made just to save us When we try to make up for never letting go Said the things we promised not to say that we break up Just to start all over even though we know
so here we are back into the kitchen just like how we started the video um, and I want to thank you guys so very much for joining me today we're 35 minutes in, and the video is about 38 minutes and so I wanted to take the last few minutes of the video to again thank you guys for joining me I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you are new I hope you consider subscribing and joining our YouTube family as we are growing I said earlier July I meant December um, but I did do a little correction at the bottom of the screen um, but I have such a huge goal of this community reaching a thousand subscriber by the end of December and I know that it's possible with your help so um, in regards to the giveaway so this is how you can enter the giveaway so uh, to win the giveaway we're going to give out two of the super clean um, products and all you have to do is go like um, my Instagram post regarding um, Friday Black Friday and what would you guys do on Friday and then to uh, like today's video uh, so go like the Instagram post and then like today's video and then three just simply let me know what you guys did on Friday um, and then leave the turkey emoji so I know to use your comment uh, to um, to put in the uh, raffle thing so um, again I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I hope you enjoyed coming along with me for the past couple of days I hope that it gave you some serious motivation from cleaning outside to cleaning inside cleaning the, the kitchen twice cleaning the dining room twice but not only that but we're getting ready into a season of um, probably the most important time of the year which is the birth of Jesus Christ and so I want to um, remind everyone that um, his love is is just amazing and almighty so um, I hope you guys will stick around while I get ready for the Christmas season and add some decorations so stay tuned for that video because that video will be next as why I'm ending this video in a cute little Christmas tune so thanks again so very much and I will see you in the next one much love and God bless